of this journey. You have been my greatest source of motivation and resilience. And to my instructor, Sir Robert Alegre Ramos, thank you for not just giving us lessons, you gave us guidance, encouragement, and the belief that we could do this. To my, to my fellow graduates, as we move forward into the next chapter of our lives, let's remember that today is not an end, it's a beginning. We now carry with us the tools, knowledge, and confidence to take on whatever challenges lie ahead. There will be obstacles, yes, but there will be also endless opportunities. The futures we have dreamed of are within reach, and it's up to us to grab them. In closing, I leave you with this. Never stop learning, never stop thinking, and never stop striving for the best version of yourself. Thank you and once again, congratulations everyone. Thank you so much, Mr. Ryan, for that lovely message that we're, would surely give all of us more motivation to pursue our dreams. Okay, so we have a special um, a presentation here today, and I will turn you over to Maria for this. Okay, thank you, Mademoiselle. Ladies and gentlemen, today marks a significant milestone of our graduates, right? As we witness their incredible journey. Our next presenter has grown in skill and confidence, mastering the art of communication, an art that extends far beyond words. Through the English Enhancement Program, she has refined her fluency, strengthened her coherence, and developed clear, precise pronunciation and intonation. But what stands out most is her ability to connect with others, engage in audience, and speak with confidence that inspires. It is with great honor that I introduce to you the Academic Hourly of English Enhancement Program. Ms. Teresa Cardenosa will now deliver an oration that embodies the growth, dedication, and transformation achieved program. Please join me in welcoming Ms. Teresa on stage. A warm applause. Yourself 
to work toward the life you've always imagined living. The preparation part of the success equation, your journey, should be celebrated. For success is not simply a destination. Success is not something that we arrive at one day. Success has everything to do with your individual day-to-day -day choices, actions, and experiences, no matter how big or small they are. Success has to do with being true to who you are and how you choose to respond to every circumstance that occurs in our life. Remember that feeling successful has much to do with who you personally define success. So ask yourself how you define success. For example, do you define success as having more in your life? More money? More recognition? More material items? Do you define success according to other people's standard? Or, or do you define success as feeling happy with who you are? Being happy with your choices and being grateful for all that you have in your life today. Aim to shift your focus from thinking of success as being something that is always out of your reach or something which involves constantly wanting or needing or keeping up with other people and focus instead on being grateful and happy for who you are and there's so much more to be grateful for. Is it there? Whatever it is you might go going through right now, regardless of how challenging it may be there is always much to be thankful for. Be grateful for who you are and fully appreciate your individuality and all that you have in your life now. Do the very best that you can do what you have now, while at the same time striving toward becoming an even version of yourself than you were yesterday. Have faith and always believe that you will achieve anything you set out to do. You are miracle, my friend. And there's no one else out there like you. Start to view yourself and your work today as a being miraculous and trust that you will create anything you set out to do. Albert Einstein said, There are only two ways to live your life. One is that though nothing is a miracle. The other is that though everything is a miracle. How do you want to live your life? Thank you and once again, congratulations fellow graduates.
Let's move on to the next survey. 
stage, Magallanes 